If there's one thing I don't like is spending more for something than I have to. So I went online, I looked at the Elgato key light and I noticed they were about 199. Awesome lights, but not an awesome price. So I kept looking around Amazon and I came across this. This is the newer USB LED powered lights and they pretty much do the same thing, but for a cheaper cost. So in this video, we're gonna take a look at these to see just how well they do. So in the box, you get a set of legs, an extension rod that extends to a little more than three and a half feet with a GoPro style mount on top and a thread on the bottom. Then of course you get the USB powered lights. Now newer says these are daylight balanced at 5600K with 66 individual LEDs on each panel. And they brighten by intervals of 10. So you can go from 10% to 100% and vice versa. Now they change brightness by using this super simple controller attached, which has an LED on it too, to show you that it has power. Now also included in the box are these plastic slidable gels. You get a white one to act as a diffuser, a red red one, a blue one, and a yellow one. And this is what the LED looks like once it's all attached and on your desk. So what I'm gonna do now is use a newer LED light instead of the light that I'm using now to show you how it looks if you use this for, let's say, YouTube or something like that. So I'm gonna switch that over now. So now this is what it looks like with the newer LED instead of my regular setup. Now I have it right off camera to the left and I have the other one behind me as a hair light. Now, as you can see, the shadows on my face are pretty harsh. So what I'm gonna do is create a little diffuser to put on top of the diffuser that's already on here to kind of make those shadows a little softer. And here's how I'm gonna do it. So all you're gonna need is some wax paper, a pair of scissors and some tape. And what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna cut a small square out of this wax paper to put in front of the LED panel so I can create a little bit more diffusion to make the shadows just a little softer on my face. So I'm gonna switch that on right now. Give me one sec. Now I'm using the newer LED with a diffuser and that wax paper on top. And as you can see, it softened the shadows on my face quite a bit. Now, if you were to get these lights and you're gonna use them for, let's say interviews or things like that, I would recommend diffusing them a little more with the wax paper so you don't get those harsh shadows. Now at the time of making this video, these LEDs are $40 on Amazon and you get two of them in the box where the Elgato, although it does much more and it's higher quality is $200. So if you're looking for a great way to up your lighting, may it be for your streams, may it be for your video conference calls for photography or videography, and you want to do it on a budget, I think these LEDs work really nice. Now keep in mind, these are USB powered, so they work with pretty much anything. You could also plug them into an iPhone or smartphone outlet, the little wall wart to get them powered, or you could put them into, let's say a laptop or a computer like I'm using here. So for 40 bucks and a little bit of tweaking, these lights are actually pretty good. And if you're interested in one of these, in a set of these rather, you can find the link in the description below. I'm Ken the Content Coach and I love making videos like this. So if you enjoyed this video, please leave a like, subscribe, and also hit that bell notification so you can see much more videos that I'm making soon. But for now, this is it. Now, if you wanna go with the Elgato Key Light, by all means, you are gonna pay more, but it does a lot more. But if you wanna save some cash and you just need a little pop of light, I think these are actually pretty good. So thanks again for stopping by and of course, go out and make something.